What's up guys, today we're talking articulation, how to get more and how to calculate RTI score. Stick it up. Okay, so articulation basically refers to vertical wheel travel. Okay, so that means how far up and down the suspension allows the wheel to travel. So the, f the more wheel travel you have, that means your wheel will always be in contact with the ground or the surface which means you'll always have traction and the ability to clear obstacles so that's fantastic when you're doing deep ruts or boulders when maximum flex is required axle articulation is vertical wheel travel or how far the axle can actually drop down separate from the chassis so you get uh, wheel travel and you get axle travel wheel articulation axle articulation so on a solid front axle like a jeep um, means that when the f one wheel goes up the other wheel drops down and that allows the suspension to conform to the terrain um, allowing for greater traction over uneven surfaces Art articulation is basically one of the most important um, criteria when determining if a vehicle can overcome a specific obstacle. So how do you get more articulation out of a vehicle? Well, the easiest way is to install an aftermarket suspension with longer shock, shocks, longer control arms and sway bar disconnect. So sway bar disconnect is basically the easiest way to get more articulation out of a vehicle, especially if it's a solid front axle with independent front suspension as well. Um, you can get improved articulation. It's never going to be as good as solid front axle. Um, and just make sure that you reconnect it when you go back onto the tarmac because if you're driving without your sway bar connected and you take a turn at speed you can easily roll that vehicle so just remember to reconnect it once you hit the tarmac that's because the sway bar doesn't want the axle to move away from the body um, so it limits your flex so nowadays most modern four-wheel drives are equipped with a traction control system especially independent front suspension vehicles they have traction control systems um, which makes up for that lack of articulation or flex when off-road um, now a traction control system works fantastic yes but it's more a reactive system so there needs to be a certain level of slippage before the system can kick in but then there's another factor that comes into play and that's ground clearance so articulation and ground clearance actually goes hand in hand especially if you are doing a cross, ax cross axle um, obstacle um, there it works fantastic because you can take it slow and you can allow the traction control to kick in as long as you f keep feeding it keep feeding it it will just work brilliantly um, but the problem is if you are lacking ground clearance the traction control actually means nothing because you will just get hung up on on the obstacle don't get me wrong i'm not knocking traction control they actually work brilliantly um, and it's actually a fantastic system however if you have ground clearance with a diff locker that's probably the ideal situation ground clearance with articulation and a diff lock is or diff lockers front and rear that's the ideal situation when doing deep rutted tracks and difficult off-road tra off trails solid front axles or solid axles with diff lockers and very good ground clearance then you've got an off-road machine of note so what is RTI score and how is it calculated? Well basically RTI is calculated when you drive the vehicle up the ramp. It's the distance the vehicle, how far the vehicle can go up the ramp measured to the center of the wheel. Right? And then they divide that by your wheelbase and multiply that by a thousand. The reason why they do that is so that vehicles of different wheelbases can compete in the same category and you can get a more accurate um, reflection of the articulation measurement. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video, I hope you learned one or two things, so yeah, if this is something you're into, if you got value out of the video, please like and subscribe and check out some of the other videos on the channel. Till next time, safe travels.